Okay, I'm taking a walk down the street and we're gonna see what they've got accomplished. They put the curbs in last week and I see the roller is out, so let's see how much asphalt they got done. Hoping the wind noise isn't too bad. I'm gonna face the camera around here. Ah, here's the roller. See how far it goes down. I'm gonna stay on the concrete part. Okay, all the way down to the grade school. And I can't tell how far up, but it looks like from now on at least I can go to that side street down there. So it looks like from now on, no driving on dirt for me. I don't know if this camera can pick it up, but it actually shakes the mirrors even in my house, that bass sound that it makes. And I'll show you what I've been up to also. I've been doing a little bit of resurfacing on my driveway. Uh, there's the Nikkor gas guy. I don't know what he's working on. See, I've got the cones set up there. Kind of getting the hard to get at sections done first. I already did this section here by where the Jeep is parked and then working my way up. It actually looks kind of messy there because I took all the surface dirt and uh, grass and stuff and just washed it down there. So it looks pretty bad right now until I hose it off. But this is the next section I'm getting done. This is to be done next. And this is another section I had to do in the middle. This was about the worst part to get done here, and I got this done last week. I think this right here is about three buckets of the surfacing stuff. Pretty good. Eight-year guarantee, and it's latex, so you can just hose everything off. You don't have to ruin any of your equipment or anything. And even if you get some on your clothes, it even rinses off, as long as it doesn't cure. So... If you get to it for about the first two hours if you get to it you can just hose all the equipment off but here's what it looks like cooking in the sun right now if it cooks for about four hours in the sun it seems to do really good so that's what I've been working on lately